Well, one of my favorite things to do is gardening. So I was just going to show you a little bit of, you know, basically what I've done with just a small yard and gardening. Um, we moved in two years ago, a little over two years ago, and there was absolutely nothing in the yard. So probably one of my favorites, let's see, is these guys. So this is passion fruit. Um, believe it or not, this is one passion fruit vine which has just completely taken over the fence in all directions. Um, it just grows like crazy. Um, those are sweet potatoes down there and I have some vegetables at the end there. Um, some peppers and jalapenos and all that stuff. But these are just amazing. Um, and then over here, you know, we've got some Hawaiian teas, um, just some various other plants. I had a lot of fun in planting all of this two years ago. Um, I really didn't plan anything. I just kind of popped everything in the ground where I thought I would like it. And it just has grown into this oasis, which I love. Um, clearly the bottom's not completely finished. We still need to put some rock and stuff covering, you know, everything there. But yeah, here's just more of one plant. <laughs> and then of course, everything in Florida grows like a complete weed. It is just insane. Oh, someone's probably looking for lizards here. Um, I do have some more vegetables down here. Um, some various other stuff, some more Hawaiian teas. And then when we come to the back, um, we've got all my big stuff. So I've got some bananas, um, some black and white birds of paradise. That's what that one is. I can't remember the name of these, but they've just grown enormous. Uh, there's a banana. We did get bananas last year. They were delicious. <laughs> they were tiny little baby bananas, but just really, really, really yummy. So there's kind of the view that way. Um, I do have some jasmine kind of growing up over the fence this direction that's trying to take off. Let's see, we're in the sun here, so it's probably kind of hard to see. Um, here's another banana, which has just gotten enormous. Uh, we've got some birds of paradise. Uh, my parents gave me this huge, huge vine that has grown all the way over. It, actually, it's not a vine, it's um, pigeon peas. But it has completely taken over and made like this really cool archway. Um, they gave me this banana a year ago. It was a tiny little baby, popped it in the ground, and it's just grown huge. Um, here's a mini bird of paradise. And another mini bird of paradise. Just love those. And this is another just passion fruit vine. I'm not sure if you can see yet. All the way down the fence. And look at the stalk on this. It is just huge. And that's just one year of growth. <laughs> the dirt here is just very sandy. Oh, someone's looking to play ball. Um, the hibiscus grow like weeds. That's one hibiscus that is actually almost as tall as the house now. Um, here's another one that's grown up this year. They're just enormous. Um, and then I've got just some more vegetables and berries and stuff down there at the end by the, by the pool equipment. So anyhow, just kind of wanted to share and just, you know, one of my most joyous things is just being out in the garden. The whole reason I really started like a garden here was there was absolutely nothing behind the house, just that tree and a giant magnolia tree, which I absolutely love, and a palm. Um, but yeah, there was nothing and everything was just wide open. Now it's very private in the pool area, which I love. And it, this is just about a year and a half of growth. I don't think I planted anything for about six months. And even cactus grow great here. <laughs> so this is Bob the cactus. And I think I'm actually going to have to put him outside soon because he is almost to the top of the pool enclosure. <laughs> so... Um, anyhow, that is my garden, my happiness, and where I like to spend my time um, pretty much all summer and spring and fall. Oh, the Florida sun is just amazing. Are you sunbathing?